Hello and welcome to your Astrological Vibrations for Wednesday, January 7th, 2015 by Gaia Blumi. I am Mimi and our energy mantra for today is, it is my responsibility to play as part of my purpose. And today we are continuing with the moon through Leo, which brings in the essence of our inner child, which embracing all of us is part of stepping into our total purpose. Therefore, we can be of service. And so it's about bringing in, you know, that play into your daily life. It's bringing in the creativity. I think it's about bringing play into every moment. You know, life is, I think we're here to be joyful. And it doesn't mean that we shouldn't embrace the other emotions that come along with the, you know, the experience, the life experience. But if we can always kind of carry on that the essence of joy, I think that helps us bring in that essence of play. So we have the moon connecting to Uranus first thing in the morning. And Uranus in Aries helps us, uh, you know, embrace our I am, embrace our new I am. And you know what I was thinking with this, with the moon and Leo connecting to Uranus and Aries, with the new year, I was asking you to do some I am work. So today, what might be a little fun, innovative thing to do is, what if your inner child did the I am work today? Instead of your inner adult answering who you are, Maybe it's time. Okay, inner child, step, step up. Who are you? And let the inner child say, I am an astronaut. I am, my inner child would say, I am a kitty cat. <laughs> um, <laughs> I have something here to prove it. I will be wearing these for this astro today. These are little um, kitty cat tight stockings. So, I am a kitty cat. <laughs> it's time to bring in that essence. And maybe that will just stimulate something within you, reawaken something within you that you would put aside that's meant to be part of your energy right now. Um, and then the other thing, love this connection. The moon is going to be meeting up with Jupiter today. So this is a really beautiful opportunity to do something nice for yourself. Do something nice for your inner child. Do something nice for your creativity that is longing to come forth, burst forth, and create. So take some time at some point today, whether it's taking yourself out shopping for something nice for yourself. Don't spend too much. Jupiter can make us be like, I am going to buy the whole store because I just love it so much. You know, check in with, check in, uh, with the heart on the Awkward Yeti. That can be, you know, the essence of Jupiter and Leo. Like, I love everything. Um, so, you know, tune in and see if it's really something for you, um, but do something nice. Just do something nice for yourself and your inner child. Beyond that, I do want to mention that Mercury is finishing up at four degrees, the first revolution evolution degree of Uranus, or Aquarius. It is Uranus degree, Aquarius. So this is actually amazing because it can really stimulate brilliance, but it can also make you feel because of your brilliance some alienation. So if you're feeling that, you know, go in again. I think your key for the next, you know, yesterday, today, and a little bit of tomorrow is really getting into that inner child and seeing where is this coming from before? Where have you felt alienated because of this before? And then the other thing that, you know, may be tuning into this as well, Venus will be moving into four degrees as well. So if you're feeling like an outcast, you're feeling like you don't belong, remember that you do that it takes every single color to make up the rainbow. We need all of them. And it takes every single person and their own essence to make life interesting and the rainbow of colors. Um, the last thing I want to mention <laughs> for me, I just feel like your inner child may appreciate this. My inner child is throwing a fit about taking down my tree. My inner child does not want to take down the tree ever. <laughs> So I'm giving my inner child through Leo, through the moon and Leo, to enjoy my Christmas tree because I really love it and it's so shiny and bright. So be kind to your inner child through this moon. If your inner child is also throwing a fit about your Christmas tree and not wanting to come down, then, you know, be nice to your inner child through this transit. And then 
our card, Louise card, and I love this. This helped me with the horoscope. It says, my motto this year is, I go for the joy. Life is here for me to enjoy today. So embrace that essence today and have a beautiful day of Moon and Leo, Sun and Capricorn. Namaste.